Alright, there's probably no spoilers in here, but Kevin Feige confirmed there will be nothing past the 15 or 20 minute mark of the movie. So I guess, spoiler warning anyway. Alright, so we start off the trailer with this bleak New York City view. And then the Statue of Liberty with all the abandoned boats. And the stadium that was, I guess, filled with people at one point and now snapped away. And then this care facility where it says, where do we go now that they are gone? Then we see Steve Rogers thinking about how half the population is gone and he doesn't want to be there and he doesn't want to let Thanos win. Okay, so now we see a shot of Tony Stark and Nebula on the Guardian ship and they are obviously repairing. I have mixed feelings on this shot because I feel like some people are saying that there is someone edited out when they're just looking at someone or something. Then we see the last Guardian of the Galaxy, Rocket Raccoon. Looks like he's going into some type of shack, maybe Bucky's little hiding space in Wakanda. Why Black Widow is doing this, I have no idea. I thought she was already a skill assassin. Okay, so we got Rhodey, aka War Machine, and Scott Lang, Ant-Man. But this even confirms even more, I guess, spoiler warning, I guess, for Ant-Man and the Wasp that he survives. Alright, so we got Thor here, and he looks really sad because he's lost a lot of people. And then we see what looks like him in Wakanda, or maybe Thanos' second planet. We have a shot of... Captain America putting on his shield. I think this trailer was pretty nice. Short, cryptic, of course. Nothing over the first 15 to 20 minutes, apparently. But remember, some things can be fake, as we saw in Infinity War trailers. 